Assalamu alaikum friends and welcome to my channel Study Law with Pushra. So today we will discuss the constitution of Pakistan 1973. What are the main features of constitution? But before starting we have to know what does the word constitution means. So the constitution means that set of rules and regulations on which a state runs is called constitution. The constitution of Pakistan 1973 consists of 280 articles and 7 schedules. So moving towards the salient features. Salient features mean basic features, main features of constitution. The number one feature of constitution is that it is written. The constitution of Pakistan is written means it is present in documentary form in black and white pages. Number two is rigid. The constitution of Pakistan is rigid. That means that the amendment procedure in constitution of Pakistan is difficult, very difficult. The two-third majority of parliament is required to amend the constitution according to article 239 of constitution of Pakistan 1973. The third main feature is independence of judiciary. Means that the judiciary is independent. Article 175 of Constitution of Pakistan describes the independence of judiciary. Judiciary is independent of any other authority. It doesn't depend upon any other authority to run itself. Number 4 is fundamental rights. Fundamental rights mean basic rights which are provided under Article 8 to 28 of Constitution of Pakistan 1973. The fifth main feature mean is rule of law. Means that the law is supreme and law says that all the citizens are equal in the eye of law in Constitution of Pakistan 1973. The next feature is single membership. Means Constitution of Pakistan says that if the person is member of National Assembly that he can't be a member of Senate at the same time. Th next is national language. According to Article 251 of Constitution, Urdu is the national language of Pakistan. The next is official language. According to Article 251 of Constitution, English is the official language of Pakistan for office work. Next is sovereignty of Allah. The constitution of Pakistan says that sovereignty belongs to Allah Almighty and laws should be made according to Islam. That means according to injunctions of Quran and Sunnah. Next is bicameralism. Bi mean two and cameralism mean chambers or houses. There are two chambers of parliament. One is senate and the other is national assembly. Next is parliamentary system. In Pakistan, there is a parliamentary form of government. That means prime minister is the head of government while the president is the head of state. Next is minority. According to article 36 of constitution of Pakistan, minorities are given the protection in the constitution. The rights of minorities should be protected. So that's all about constitution.